we felt that for many years that there wasn't enough um, safety provisions um, and traffic calming around there. One month after a life threatening hit and run in Calgary's Crescent Heights, a community association is speaking out. They say that more needs to be done to ensure the safety of drivers and pedestrians on First Street Northwest. And unfortunately, this recent incident has uh, demonstrated that um, these limited provisions that were put in were not enough. Marie Semenik Evans is a board member with the association. In September of 2021, the board addressed concerns with traffic calming outside Crescent Heights High School. In response this fall, the city's livable street team installed temporary curb extensions outside the school. Semenik Evans says they were hoping for more. We definitely asked specifically for speed bumps on 9th Avenue Northwest, 1st Street Northwest, and 11th Avenue Northwest. And we um, looked at, we had discussions about uh, narrowing the roads by extending the boulevard for the school. The city also conducted speed studies in September and October of 2021. Their results found that most people traveling along the road actually moved below the speed limit. I guess our concern is it, it doesn't matter how many cars speed, it's that cars can speed. And um, this last unfortunate incident highlights that. In a statement to City News, the Calgary Board of Education wrote that traffic safety is a shared responsibility, adding that they take the safety of students and staff very seriously. The city, meanwhile, did not respond to our request for comments in time for broadcast. In Calgary, Tate Laycraft, City News.